Hey guys, welcome back. Bodie 101 here, and we're back in the world of Daybreaker, picking up sheer moments after we left off. In the last episode, we made all this stuff from Equivalent Exchange 3. We derped our way through making this table, but we got it to work. So, let me kind of sh show you what this does. So, if I put a piece of cobble in here, you're going to see it's, it's doing its cryptic writing. And basically what it's doing is, is that it's learning what cobble is. Okay? And it's gone. So if we come in here, and I actually don't have any more cobble on me. Let me grab, because we have so much cobble. Like seriously, I'm just going to grab all of this. So I take this, right? And I put it in here. In these places. And basically we got an energy value. We got the EE value, okay? I'll put some of this away. Grab too much. Alright, so... We have all this energy in here, and this is all the stuff that's that's kind of loaded up. What if we put it in the middle? I can't do that. Okay, and you can see we have cobble, and it shows it has an energy value of one. So if we take this one piece of cobble out, it took out some of the stuff there. So now, if we take something like this, let's see what lapis consists of. 864, that's a more manageable number. So we take the lapis, we put this in here, and it'll start to learn it. So any item in the game that has an EE value, so uh, this hoe doesn't, but and neither does this stuff. Wow, there's a lot of stuff that doesn't have it. Iron does. 256. So for one piece of iron, I have to put in 256 cobble, for example. Or one piece of iron could give me 256 cobble. So, all right. So now that is learned. So if we go in here, sometimes... Oh, that. Sometimes we have to take our book out to... Why am I not getting any more? Where'd my cobble go? Uh, lapis? Huh. Let's look at this real quick. It learned lapis. Okay. This should kind of work from one to the other. They should kind of communicate with each other. Yeah, lapis is in there. Maybe I gotta... Let's see. How do I cook this stuff up, though? I put it here? 69. Alright, maybe I gotta, I gotta put more stuff in. So let's... um. I have a ton of redstone. So redstone has an energy value of 32, which is a lot better than cobble. So if I put this in there... Okay. So now I can start taking out pieces of lapis as long as I have the stuff to do it with. Right? So you, you kind of see how it's really not overpowered because I have to sacrifice better things to get better things. So apparently making cobble doesn't help. Let's put this away. All right, so, but here's another cool thing. So let's say we grab a piece of stone. A piece of stone has an, also has an energy value of one, right? <coughs> so if we put this in here, it's going to learn stone. I put all that cobble away. But this is where it can be super helpful because cobble and stone, other than the fact that you have to cook it, are pretty much the same thing, you know, same thing. So we got that in here. So if I put this in here. Let's take this redstone out. Now... I just took out a stack and a half of stone. I don't have to cook it. And that's actually where it gets pretty cool. And then, of course, with a diamond, we put a diamond in here to learn. This will take a little bit longer. Now, one big thing that I want it to learn, and I don't know if this has... Oh, it doesn't. Yeah, that's fine. I actually did a lot of mining. You can see I have 111 of those because I was cleared out downstairs. So we're kind of just looking for things that have energy values. There's a lot of this that doesn't. So I can do wood. Oh, I can't do these. Can I make... These don't have an energy value either, so I don't think I can make it learn these then. Oh, I was hoping to be able to make gears this way. Oh, they got me. They got me. Um... None of these tools have it either. I'm very surprised by that. 
Even slabs? Weird. Wow, they must have really... I might need to update because I think this is a little bit broken because I know there's a lot more stuff you should be able to, to do this with. Uh, coal, for example, has 32. So if we stick this in here, we can learn that. Uh, let's see. What about sand? Sand might be something for glass because I don't think glass has it. Let's see. Oh, no, glass does have it. Okay, so that, see, there's another one that's super helpful. We could trade cobble for glass. So it's not something that's necessarily going to completely break the game at all. So let's make some coal and see if we, we kind of take stuff out and move it around, put some more in. Should be able to do some stuff. Okay, so now sand should be in there. And let's, or no, glass. Let's put some sand in there to learn that as well. So this will just kind of make things, some of the things that we need a little bit more. Hand oh, this could be, this could be a game breaker. Let's see something here. Let's pop up here. Open up. And let's get, do I have any wheat? I do. I think wheat might have some. Let's see. It does. So the idea here is, is that if we have cobble, we could just basically, or just anything that we don't need a lot of we could just throw it in here have it learn it and start switching out you know cobble for wheat and we could use wheat to get us uh stuff we need so let's actually grab let's grab some more of this cobble oops okay so if we come over here and we put a bunch of this cobble in so we are now trading cobble for wheat. We just got 21 out of that. 24. Now, we don't even really need the wheat farm anymore because now we can come down here and we've got power. Hey, I think this bad boy should be pretty good. Let's throw that in there. Let's hop down here and see how our digital miner is doing. I believe it has a built-in... Um, what should I call it? Now, one thing I am going to do. Oh, this may be a bad idea. Okay, so if I look in here, we have it just set to ores, right? Um, let's do this. Oh, not what I meant to do. I meant to do this. Let's get that in there. Now, if we go in here and I stop it, and oh, why can I not configure it? Apparently, I can't configure it anymore. Auto pull, silk touch, reset. Okay. So let's get rid of this and then let's turn it back on. What? What's going on? Okay. All right. So the visuals are on. Shut the visuals off. All is not well. You're not working. Do I have to break this? Reset it? Did I mess this thing up? What did I do? Alright, let's move it over here then. Let's put it right here. Okay. What did I do? I, bro I broke it at it. Okay, start. I have no idea what I just did. All right, visuals on. Okay, so we can see the box it's going to do, right? Oh, you know why? Because I'm dumb. Okay, stop, reset, configure. I guess let's just do this. Uh, where do I? Cross place now. Or directory? Uh, what was it? Or star? Is that right? All right. Well, never mind. We'll do it this way then. 
Okay. Let's go get our chests. Turn. Ah, eh, you know, we'll leave it on. Why not? It looks neat. Meow. All right. Uh, this is probably going to hurt a little bit, but... Uh, Alright, so we'll get one set up. We'll just do one over here for now. Just so I have some place to go. Alright, yeah, I don't know. I, that thing got goofy. It's like I'm putting it on its butt. I don't like it. Alright, so let's head home. Let's get back into our cooler chase. I was going to try and get that to also start getting cobble, but uh, I'm just not going to worry about it, so... Alright, so we were able to get wheat going. Um... One other thing that would be nice would be obsidian. Now, let's see. Uh, uh, yeah, it does. Sweet. So, we would have to sacrifice a full thing of cobble to get one obsidian. So, you can kind of see. Is there anything back here going on yet? See, F7. Look, it's all dark. I guess I'm just up. I was far enough. I was far away right then. Okay, so we kind of got that going. So that that's that's uh, pretty cool. So, I, like I said, I think there's a little bit of a glitch because... Let's see. Because I can remember a lot of this stuff having... Exchange values. Um, I mean, I guess this is kind of cool. We can make sugar cane. Hmm. Well, you know, we can make sand, put the sand in, we can make glass, put the glass in, make more glass. And since it's equivalent exchange, we don't really lose out on anything. So we have that that set up now. So, All right, so we got that going, we got this going. I don't know what the heck's going on down here. Let's, um, for the rest of this episode, let's kind of, I want to kind of get back and play a little bit with this, this apple tree thing, whatever it is. Uh, apple milk and tea. So let's get this up. Because there's some other stuff in here that I didn't quite understand what it was. So let's try and make some of this stuff and see what it is and what it does. We might just, you know, craft it and see what happens. We might get pleasantly surprised. So let's see. Um, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. So the first thing we're going to make is we're going to try making one of these oak log box. Oh, okay. So if I put this down, is this literally just for looks? Okay, well, there we go. We got a decoration piece. That doesn't help us at all. Spruce logs, birch log box. I don't understand what these do, but they look neat. Okay, what about this? Uh, it's scary outside. Apple box. So we need a whole bunch of apples, which I don't think we have. Are some of these things just decorative? I hate to use all my apples for this. Okay, we can break it back down. Okay. Fuel. Yeah, I think this is just a way to store them, so... Okay. Alright, so if we do this, we get our apples back. Alright. That doesn't... Shut up, weather. Let's do this. Let's sleep. Hopefully they'll make the rain go away. Alright. So it looks like a lot of these are just decorative, and I'm assuming if I take this and put it back... Okay. So it's just ways to store things. That's that's kooky. And I'm assuming these are the same. Okay. Charcoal container. Gunpowder. Okay. So it's a way just to kind of condense things. I guess. To have them. Still seems weird. Slime ball container. Okay. So then we got some plants. Alright. We got most of this stuff here. Empty large bottle. So what are these for? Uh, uses. I can literally just... So these are just for... So it looks like a lot of this is... So I make a brewing barrel that way. What are the uses on this? Okay. So flu young beer to beer. Young wine to wine. Okay, so we're, we're making hooch here. Rum. Uh, sake. 
Brandy, whiskey. God, I should show Snoop this. He'd love it. All right. So, and those are just using the fuel. So, let's make one of these. Where'd it go? Uh, brewing barrel. So, we need... Do I have any more? I don't. All right. So, I think if we just put leather, I believe it was, in our inventory. We should get that glue stuff. And I think we should have leather somewhere. Let's see something. Uses. Food plate on fire. Okay, so we'll take this. And we'll come up here. And let's actually grab... Uh, smoke wood. So if we take this and put it on here... Okay. Apparently it does one at a time. But it's pretty quick, and it gives us leather. And then we take that leather part of this mod, makes us that. Okay. All right, so that's kind of cool. That I, We actually have one of these machines doing something. Did I make... Okay, so did I make a crafting table? Um, all right, so we got glue, and we got the wood. Oh, little lag spike there. We got ourselves a brewing barrel. Now, let's see. Can we put this, like, here? Okay. No GUI for it. This, this whole mod is just weird. Okay. So, let's see how we make some hooch here. Uses. So, how do I make wine? Oh, I won't show me how to make wine. So, do I just, like, click it with grapes, maybe? Let's see. Uses on these makes a uh, grated berry. Berry chocolate. Chocolate fondue. Yes, please. Okay. What are these? Oh, whiskey bottle. Okay. All right. So what is this? All right. So Cassius liquor bottle young. And then what do we do use these for? Nothing. Oh, my God. This is going to drive me crazy. All right. What are the uses on these? Makes oil cake in an evaporator. What is oil cake used for? This we're just learning here. A jaw crusher. Why would I want to make dirt? You know how I get dirt? I go outside. That seems like a weird thing. I don't understand what's happening and stop making me burn everything but we can see something here real quick see these are saying no energy exchange value either that does wow they did not tie the mods in together so um let's actually cook up some of these clams while we're here take that oh oh Well, we can eat it. Okay. All right. So apparently there's a lot more machines we have to make in this, and I just don't get it. Desk lamp. I don't... It's This is just a weird mod because it's like jars and lamps, but then like food processing machines and a lot of just putting things in things. There was this, but we needed another food processor. The ice maker, we needed an ice crystal, which we don't have anything with silk touch right now. That was the only way to make that. How else can we get ice? I think we already looked at this. I guess we could... Uh, I don't know if I'm going to get into blood magic quite yet. Evaporator. That doesn't look too bad. White stained clay. It's on the next page here. Like, what is that? A Gatling gun? A fossil cannon? Baked apple. Oh, that's cool. I like that. So there are some different foods here. Um, just make the sandwich. Yeah, just bread and sugar. Okay. I mean, it's... It's kind of a cool food mod, but it's like... I don't know. Maybe I'm just so, like, pampered by Pam's Harvest Craft. And... Um, Unfiltered vodka bucket. How do I get any of this stuff? 
Okay, so we take the vegetable oil to make vegetable oil bottles. So it's the same thing here, yeah. How do we get this stuff? It won't show me. Okay, so we put gold. Sometimes we get strange slag. What's the uses for strange slag? Nothing! Do you see? Oh, I don't know how I feel about this mod. You guys let me know if this is something I should kind of keep playing with because I'm just getting weirdness out of it. Minced fish and vegetable. That, does, that doesn't That does sound good. Uh, minced chocolate. Oh, I'm not going to complain about that. So it's just mince stuff. And then, of course, you can cook it. Hmm. Oh, a fire starter. Oh, a wicked fire starter. That was a horrible joke. How do I get these blocks? Lapis and... Yeah, how do I get these blocks? I guess I just find them. Yeah, so this is a weird mod. I don't, I don't know how I feel about it, so... All right, guys, so this was kind of a, a, a weird episode. Um, that apple milk and tea, let me know what you guys think of it. Maybe some of you guys know more about it. And, yeah, like I said, we got this bad boy going, so that stuff we can kind of throw in there, and that stuff we can kind of throw in there. So, All right, guys, well, we're going to wrap things up there. So um, kind of a weird off episode, just trying to figure out some things. We'll probably start looking at some of these other mods and, and start getting into some some kookiness and whatnot really honestly what i need to gear up for which probably will be a couple episodes away i think we're going to use this series to go to space uh this does have galactic craft in it i'm going to have to it's been an awfully long time because we were supposed to go into space and blast off but no that didn't happen so i figured you know what I owe you guys some space travel, some space walking, and I think we'll do it in this series. So probably a couple episodes from now, we'll get geared up for that. I have an idea for next episode I already want to do, and we're going to actually record that one next. So thanks for hanging out, guys. If you liked the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Questions, comments, concerns, leave it down in the comment section. And until the next episode of Daybreaker, I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out. We'll see you next time. Bye.